Yes, for this. Well, thank you, old lady Gibson. Most kind of you. And what's the way back to Repcon? Let's see, the dinosaur's there. Follow the road out that way. So, alright. We'll head on back. Help old Chrissy out, you know. Ah. The lake's been hurting something fierce. I think one of those big purple demons got me, you know. I should have paid that doctor lady for a little patch up. But let's face it, I'm a little bit cheap, you know what I mean? I was perfectly willing to uh, give myself to an old woman so I wouldn't have to hand over 500 caps for a fucking thrust control module. My dick is gonna get these ghouls into space. How many other people can say that, huh? <laughs> so I'm the best at what I do. Ain't that right? Old Lady Gibson. You know, maybe I throw her a bone just uh, as a as a thank you. Say I know you I know you didn't want this, but maybe just maybe just have it anyways. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, but probably not. <laughs> Yeah, maybe 20 years ago, you know? Maybe 20 years ago, or if she stopped by Gamora with 500 caps for me. Then we can make something happen. As it is, getting by on my good looks, as always. But I've seen some people coming in from the wasteland, even if they are, you know, 20, 30 years old. God damn, they look banged up. I think if I do make it back to Gamora, I'm not gonna look the same. A couple more bullet holes, a little scratch on the face there. You know, people are paying good money. So they want what they what they pay for. Does that make sense? You're paying money, you want the best. And maybe uh I won't be the best no more. Still decent. Not five hundred caps anymore though. Maybe uh maybe two hundred, something like that. Yeah, that sounds about right. Now, where is that hatch? In just a minute since I've been over here. I think it was uh, somewhere... Somewhere over this way. I could be wrong. I've been wrong before. Hmm. Well, well. I don't want to have to go back into Repcon. It's gonna be a major pain in the ass. I'm sure it's hidden just over this way. Tucked away in a corner, as it should be. There we are. Alright. Let's see what it do. Every day. Doing stupid crap. But at least uh, this might win me some good fortune, huh? Hey, Chrissy. Hey, have you found the components we discussed? Yeah, uh, you don't want to know how I got this, so just, just take it. Indeed you did. And they seem to be in excellent condition. Good enough. So, uh, the rockets are good to go? Yes. I'll tell Jason that the great journey can begin. Good, good. Ah. We have everything we need to launch the rockets, Jason. The great journey Look, can these begin. These getting all suited up. There they go. They're all lined up in a pretty row. Gather all. May the Creator guide my words and help me speak true. The Almighty Creator has seen fit to answer our prayers. The time has come for us to board the rockets and begin the great journey. Though it may seem that all humans despise us. The Creator has seen fit to instruct us differently. The journey ahead would have been impossible if not for the intercession of two human friends. One you, the other a long-abiding companion. To our new friend, we say thanks and promise never to forget how he cleared from our path the demons who sought to stay our journey. But to Chris, we owe more than thanks. Chris, you 
have made this great journey a reality. From this moment forward, you will be remembered as the saint of the great journey. We shall never forget you. You ain't going with it, Chris. I ask that you forgive us, Chris, and give us your blessing. And we bestow ours upon you. Seekers, board the rockets. Take your seats. The great journey awaits. To the promised land we go. To the far beyond. Hey, hey, hey. It's fucked up, ain't it, Chris? Hello. Bet you didn't know about all that, did you? You feeling a certain type of way about it, or what? Did you hear him? My god, you were right all along. I'm no ghoul. They were just using me. Yeah, I'm sorry, Chris. I tried to tell you, didn't I? Well, I'll tell you like this. You know, Jason talked to me about it, and he basically said that, uh, you'd die if you made it to the great beyond. Does that help you feel a little better about it? If you're not a ghoul, you can go rejoin society. I don't see why it's a big fucking deal. I know a nice casino I can get you a job at, if you don't mind selling your butt. And dying would be worse than this? Used up and thrown away like garbage? Hmm. Well, that's true. Maybe they're right, you know? I can see why they would leave you behind. You're kinda... pathetic. You're kinda petulant. You sound like a little child, whining and crying and bitching. Like, you know, they already told you once that you ain't no ghoul, and you're like, yes I am, I'm going with you. Well, I think they're doing the right thing by leaving you behind, honestly. Leave me alone. Everyone else does. Nah, I'm sorry, Chris. I didn't mean it. Yes, I did. I halfway did. Come on, y'all, hop in your fucking little ship. Hop in your ship and go for a ride, huh? I don't know what the fuck is oh. going on. Just walk amongst yourselves, I suppose. I was hoping to see some fucking rockets, you know? At least enjoy the work that I put in. Something like that. Ah. I don't understand. This is the rocket supposed to be taking off. They're like underground somewhere. Hmm. What if I could go pry the hatch open or something? Yeah, talk to Jason through the intercom. Say hey buddy. Hey baby. You need me to push the button for you? Excuse me, Chris. I'm I'm leaving you alone. Bye. I'm trying to hit that, that intercom behind you. Oh. Hello? It doesn't work. It doesn't work. Don't nobody want to talk to me. Alright, come on. These fucking dudes. I don't know what he's doing over there. Playing with his butt or something like that. And these fucking guys don't even want to go anywhere. I'll tell you that right now. They ain't excited. I did all this fucking work for them and they're just gonna sit around with the dick in their hands. Good lord. Is there another button that I'm supposed to push to help these fucking guys out? Dude said get in the rocket. If you ain't in the rocket, you don't get to fucking go. That's all there is to it. Hey, Mentats. Hey, Stimpak. Hey, Medex. Glad I checked that table. I tell you that. I tell you true. Hmm. It's gotta be somewhere. Somewhere I'm supposed to go. Some buttons I'm supposed to push. These fucking guys don't want to talk to me. I don't understand what's going on with these fucking ghouls. They're gonna piss me off one way or the other. I'll tell you that right now. I don't understand. Because I hurt fucking Chris's feelings. The the whole thing's off. Everything you did, just, just fuck you, Nick. You know what I'm saying? Oh, they ain't gonna stand. Not at all. Hey, Antler. How you living? Hey, Davison. What's up, dude? Uh, I think we have to go back. Go back to where they was uh, playing around with all them machines upstairs, right? 
can't remember how to get out of this place. That's gonna be trouble. Any hey, wires going upstairs? That's what I'm looking for. Thank goodness. Ah, these ghouls frustrate me to no end. I tell you that. You know what I fucking did for you? You know, I got rid of your your feral brethren, so you could have a nice life, not have your reputation ruined by brainless zombies. I clear out all these nightkins. I find a bunch of bullshit. I offer to sleep with an old fucking lady, and and nobody's fucking giving me my fair dues. So you know what? You know what? That's fine. Absolutely, just just great. So this is where they was uh, pushing all the buttons, right? Hey, what's going on over here? I'm supposed to push one of these? I don't know what the fuck's going on. There we are. Look at this. I think that's the dome where the fucking rockets are. So, uh, what do we do? Fiddle with this one? Yeah. I don't quite know what I'm looking at here. Well, I guess that's well enough. Hmm. Do I have a, a magazine? Something that can make me a little bit smarter? That will really be helpful to me. I don't know if it's gonna make me smart enough, though. Therein lies the problem, huh? Well, there's gotta be another button I could push. Maybe I just mash on that console, you know? Never a bad idea. Yeah. No buttons on here. How about this one? Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Right, go to the moon, you fucking glorious bastards. You and I both know they ain't gonna make it. It's kinda comical in its way. You're just gonna fucking be flung into space. Oh my god. One of them definitely ain't gonna make it. Got knocked all off course. And, uh, that's about it. So, the people of Novak will hear of my great deeds. They shall say, wonderful job, Nick. You got rid of the ghouls, how'd you do it? And I'll say, it's a trade secret. We don't talk about that. Ah. It feels good. I gotta be honest with you. It feels pretty fucking good. Alrighty. Let's see what we could do here. Welcome to level 4, they said. Fantastic. Hmm. Let's get educated. I can be a little bit smarter. Oh, that's, uh, two levels? Are you sure? Fuck it. Fuck it, I say. Let's pump that bottle right up. Wonderfully done. Alright, now I just gotta get out of this hellhole. Shouldn't be any more ghouls in my way. Nobody can stop me now. Ah. Well, it is a job well done, you know? I was a little bit worried that because Chris was left behind that they, uh... They'd be upset. All of them would just be upset. And they'd be like, hey, we ain't going. We ain't going because Chris feels bad about it. They realize better. They should uh, have a talk with old Chris. Say, hey, look, buddy, I'm sorry. Let me put you out of your misery. Pow, pow! Eh, probably not even worth a couple of bullets. It would be a waste, in my opinion. I still feel sort of bad. But honestly, you shouldn't be such a whiny bitch. Sounds like a little schoolgirl. Oh, where, where? They're gonna leave me behind. Well, they fucking told you before, didn't they? You ain't a ghoul. You ain't a ghoul, get real. But he didn't. He just couldn't. Look at all this stuff here. 
couple of sensor modules. I got no use for that now. Yeah, we beat, we beat back these demons, no problem, right? Hmm. Now where's that antler? There you are. I guess I could have gone through the whole Repcon headquarters, whatever. But I know there's an easy way out down here. Oh my, what was that incandescent glow? Ah, it's empty. But I'm pretty sure there was some Nuka-Cola Quantum in there. It looked like that bottle had some uh, glowing residue in it, did it not? Scrap metal. Pretty useful for quite a few things. Ah, poor Chris. Poor old Chris. Did he watch the launch? I hope he saw it. I also hope that I uh, left a couple of them ghouls behind. Or maybe he snuck onto one of the uh, one of the rockets there. Yep, they're gone. Nobody here but us chickens. Well, that's the job well done. Old Nick's first step on his pathway to fame. Hey, and what do you know, it's morning again. Super. Wonderful job, everybody. Guess I could uh, head on back to Novak. Let people know how it went for me. Ah. I guess I could give old Boone a second chance as well. I don't want to get too buddy-buddy with the NCR. Because, uh... My family... The family that I call my family... Are allied with Caesar's Legion. The Omantis. Although not many people on the Strip know about that just yet. So, I could side with them. The people that I've called my family. Or I could go look for my, my father. My blood. You know? And he's part of the NCR. So it leaves me with quite a little conflict to deal with. What a contradiction. You know what I'm saying? Ah, you just can't win. One way or the other, somebody's got to be disappointed. Now, my heart tells me to go with my blood. You know, <clears throat> I'd like to meet my dad. I don't want to have to fight him. But my brain, the sensible side of me, says stick with what's been working it's been working for you so just uh don't fucking rock the boat with the omantis it's god knows even if they call you family they're not gonna hesitate to put a knife in your back the second you wander too far off the path they laid out for you you're gonna get laid out you know what i'm saying ah it's rough it's fucking rough I think that's uh, part of the reason why I left, you know. I don't want to get involved with Caesar's Legion. I'm just trying to be myself, you know. Do my own thing. Have a good old time. Maybe make a few bucks, meet a few people along the way. Who knows? Poseidon Energy. Yeah, we read all about them. They're, they're family. They're a family that says you can't talk to your other family. That has your wife and your kids and your drinking buddies in it. What the fuck? Excuse me? Who, who do you think you are? Pilot light, scrap electronics. Ah. I just borrow some of this stuff. Yeah. Sensor module. Now what are you gonna do with all that, Nick? I don't fucking know. It just seems like a good thing to have, doesn't it? What if I gotta make something? Come on! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hey, buddy. What are you gonna do with that? They just made friends here. And now, uh... We're making enemies. Back it up. Back it up, friend. You and your little fucking knife. You're not gonna like what I got for you. Drake, this fella out into the desert. Let the fucking geckos and mole rats tear him apart. 
for this blood on in on my hands. At the very least. Think I wanna beat this dude down? He ain't got shit, look at him. He's wearing uh leather armor. You like that? A little bit of cloth. It's pathetic. Alright. You wanna get it? Fucking get it. This if this really how you want it to be. Alright. You asked for this. Ugh. Hey, sorry about it, buddy. You know, two bottle caps to his name. Fucking pathetic. <sighs> He's seen the wrong thing, you know what I mean? It's like, hey, you shouldn't steal that stuff, I'm gonna attack you. Well, guess what? You should've just fucking looked the other way. You know? You could see it, and you could just be like, alright. I guess that's the thing that happens. Don't get your fucking self involved. You're gonna end up like that dude every time. Good god. I don't feel good about it. I thought uh, people in Novak would like me, but uh... Yeah, apparently... Apparently I kinda screwed that up just a little bit. Yeah. Oh well. One, two, three... Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends.